This video provides a step-by-step -step guide for setting up remote viewing for your Cocoon digital security system. Please note, the menu systems for routers vary greatly. For help navigating your router's menu, please contact your router manufacturer. To begin, ensure your security system is connected to a PowerPoint, the security system is connected to a monitor via the HDMI cable, and a LAN cable is connected to a router or modem. You will first need to access your router to ensure DHCP and UPnP are enabled. To access your router, please contact your router manufacturer to obtain your IP address. Menu layouts of routers vary greatly. For help navigating your router, contact your router manufacturer. Navigate to your local network settings and ensure DHCP is enabled. If it is not, follow the required steps in your router to enable it. Now navigate to your UPnP settings and ensure this is enabled. If it is not, follow the required steps in your router to enable it. On the home screen of the Cocoon Digital Security System, right-click on your mouse to bring up the pop-up menu and select Main Menu, then select the Network Menu. Set the type as DHCP and choose which ports you would like to forward. We suggest Mobile Port as 18004, Client Port as 09000 and HTTP Port as 08080. Take note of your IP address as we will use this in the router later. Now change Auto Port Forwarding to Enable and click Apply. Exit back to the home screen and the Cocoon Digital Security System will prompt you to reboot it. You will now need to set up port forwarding on your router. Setting up port forwarding on routers varies greatly. For help setting up port forwarding on your router, contact your router manufacturer. You will now need to enter the ports you wish to forward. As per the setup on the Cocoon Digital Security System, we suggest Client Port as 09000, HTTP Port as 08080, and the mobile port as 18004. On some routers, you will need to enter the IP address of the Cocoon Digital Security System. This will be displayed on the network screen of the Cocoon Digital Security System beside the heading IP address. On the router in our example, we now need to assign the port forward rules to a particular device. Select the port forward rules and then assign them to the Cocoon Digital Security System. Congratulations, you have successfully set up remote viewing on the Cocoon Digital Security System. For more detail, or for how to access the DVR remotely, please see the attached network setup guide.